Hi, I'm Jason, and this is the Cultural Breakdown. Well, it looks like the corpse of the Little Mermaid isn't even cold yet, and Disney is already talking about more live-action remakes. Disney teases its Lion King cinematic universe plans. As part of a recent interview, one Disney executive teased the potential for a Lion King cinematic universe. While only a middling critical success back in 2019, Jon Favreau's live-action Lion King remake proved to be the financial juggernaut for Disney, becoming the box office draw that year and ninth highest grossing movie of all time see what's going on is with their live action remakes they're not doing as good as what they're hoping for and so what they're doing is instead of being more creative and trying to get better they're deciding hey hey let's go back to the drawing board what what have we done before that actually did good lion king okay let's do more of that it was such a win for a house of mouse that the studio was quick to greenlight a live action follow-up titled Mufasa, the King, uh, the Lion King from Oscar winning director Barry Jenkins. Yeah, when people saw the Lion King, were people ever wondering what happened to Mufasa, his upbringing, how he became king, what was like in his reign? No, that's not important. It was a contained story that just had it was about Simba and him growing up to become the king and learning how to do that. It doesn't need to have a cinematic universe. This is just a an example of what's wrong with the studios right now they have no creativity anymore they don't know what they're doing so instead of trying to figure something out and hiring good writers they're just going back and just beating dead horses until there's no more to get look at what they've done with marvel what the, what they've done with star wars they buy ips because they had no more ideas they milk those until they're dry until people it, don't even want to see them anymore and then they discard those and be like okay now what are we going to do well, let's go back to our uh, our inventory and see what we have oh we have these movies that we haven't remade before let's remake those uh, live action now because that's the only thing we can do different is live action and people are just getting tired of it look at this disney slam for what live action the lion king cinematic universe Disney's films have an illustrious and captivating history that has enthralled audiences for many years. The Walt Disney Company's unwavering commitment to creativity, innovation, and heartfelt storytelling has firmly embedded the film into the fabric of popular culture. Yeah, I grew up on these movies, and a lot of people do, especially the animated ones at least, and those are good movies. They're timeless classics. By making them live action, or this one's even not even live action, it's animated. It All it does is just date it and cheapen it. They don't add anything to it. They just make it longer or maybe add some unnecessary subplots or but i mean the story is not any better they don't improve anything they just redo it because they have nothing else to do they're basically creatively tracing what better people have done before them and it it just doesn't work anymore and look, and look at this. This is why they're doing this. Disney completes 7,000 job cuts. Disney reached a 7,000 layoff goal handling, handing out notices to the remaining employees impacted in the third round of job cuts last Friday ahead of the Memorial Day holiday weekend, Variety has confirmed. The Mouse House targeted was concluded these company-wide layoffs, which focused most heavily on media divisions and left the parks largely untouched. Yeah, the parks are the only thing that's actually bringing Disney itself money, and even then, that's not going good. But look at what, when they're trying to save money, what are they going to do? They're going to cut the entertainment industry because that's not the good one. That's not the one bringing in the profit. It just goes back to what I'm saying is they have no creativity. Their, mo their movies are losing money. And then they're just having to redo the same thing over again. And even with this Lion King one, I'm like, I'm I'm not gonna doubt that Mufasa is probably gonna turn a profit because it's not it, it because it is riding on the back of the previous one. And even though we've had like a bunch of failure live action ones since then, people are probably gonna be like, oh, the Lion King Mufasa, let's go see it. And you know, I actually do hope it is good. Uh, sincerely, I mean. Having a prequel to it is at least somewhat creative, but it's still unnecessary. I mean, you can do so much more. If you want to make a movie about uh, animals, Disney has made tons of movies about animals in the past. I'm not saying remake one of those. I'm saying make another movie about animals and stuff like that. It, it Why not do that? They did that all the time in the past. I mean, and with the technology they had for The Lion King, yeah, it looked good. The, the character designs weren't good, but... That could be fixed if they wanted to. So they should just do something like that instead of just remaking something else or at least not having something a part of another franchise. And the whole Lion King universe, I mean, is there really much you can do? I mean, I guess it it is just what I'm saying. Like, have a movie about animals or whatever and then, like, you give them character and it's like, oh, but they're only setting it in a Lion King universe because otherwise people won't pay attention to it. Honestly, I would rather them just 
this is what they really need to do. They really need to stop having these big budget movies. You don't need to make a billion dollars. How about just spend little bits of money on it? Maybe like a cheap $20 million movie. That would be nothing compared to the $200 million movies that they're doing. Throw a little bit of money at other uh, ideas. Give some writers more creative control or give them directors more creative control over a project. Give them a little bit of money and see what they can do. It doesn't even have to be a hit. It just has to be decent and it'll turn a big prop for them and they can keep themselves afloat and they won't have to be laying off people all the time. At least uh, that's just what I think. Let me know what you think at least. Uh, if you want to see more, subscribe to the channel and uh, make sure to like the video and share it. Thank you.